Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Webdev. In this video, we will see about the concept, the important concept in the regular expression. That is nothing but greediness and the laziness of the regular expression. So this is one of the important concept we need to understand about the greediness nature of the regular expression. In our previous video, I have told that regular expression are not greedy, right? Sorry, I, I was wrong. Actually, it was, I, I suppose to say that regular expressions by default are greedy. So they are not greedy. So they, they are not lazy. So by default, regular expressions are greedy actually. Here, I will show you what is this greedy nature and how we can convert this greedy nature to the lazy. Let's try to see it. So let's say that I have a paragraph here. Okay. So I'm having a paragraph, something like opening the P tag. And here we are having a paragraph and we are closing the p tag. And same scenario, we are having a p tag and all those things. Now we need now my sin my scenario is I need to find the paragraph element, the opening and closing tags so up to here. I found I, I need to find the list of all the paragraph elements. So that means I need to match it. So now let's try to write the regular expression for this one. So what I need to write here, I need to write p tag and also the closing p tag so here i can use this escape meta character now here we are trying to match open p tag and also the closing p tag now in between this one so we can have zero or more characters any characters we can have zero or more characters so that means any any type of character so we can have any type of character so for that reason what we can do so we can mention it with while card meta character that is nothing but dot and we need to have zero or more. So zero or more means we can represent it with a star. So now if you try to see here, okay, I will try to remove this flag global thing. So now if, it, if, you, if you try to see here, it is able to find the first match, but the match how it is trying to make is, it is trying to match entire paragraph up to the last here. But it should not be like this so it should match up to here only and this should be a second match okay so this should happen it like this but it is not happening like that because of the greedy nature for example let's say that if you try to see first it has found the opening p tag yes and here it is able to see that dot and star that means any character zero or more times now what it will try to do here it will start matching this one so zero or more times it will go on matching here and here if you try to see so this one this opening tag and the closing tag also matches here why because with a dot thing so it is an of any type character now these all are matching here is also matching and it will go on matching like this matching and up to here it will match it so now it understood that so here there is no match now it understood that okay i have completed this one so i need to check again this one so then now it has understood now it needs to find this match also now it will try to backtrack the code here it will try to see okay and match has not been found it again it will come to backtrack here again it will come to backtrack backtrack like this so it will go on coming backtrack like this sorry it will go on so here the match has been found and it will stop here up to here for example if you don't have this one let's say it will match up to here only so it will go on match here up to here it will go okay and it will come again with the backtracking thing so here it will up to here it will come backtrack so until and unless it finds this closing p element okay so here it has found this closing p element so that is the reason it has went into this one up to the end of the thing so it should not happen like this so because of the greedy nature of the regular expression so it went capturing as much text as it can so it is trying to capture as much text as it can and then afterwards after completion of this dot and star capturing all the element all the text and then it has realized that i need to check for this one also at then then it will start again to backtrack this code so here it will try to backtrack this code until and unless it will find a match for this one so this is the thing it will try to do it so this is called as an by default greedy nature so that means it is going to the end of the thing and it is backtracking so now what I want is, so instead of having this greedy nature, I want to convert this one to a lazy thing. Okay. I want to convert this one to a lazy thing. So how can I convert this one to a lazy thing is, so let's say that I am keeping here a question mark. So question mark means that, that is nothing but zero or one. 
so zero or one so here if you try to see here immediately this has been converted into the lazy nature if i enable this global thing so now it is able to find four matches so this is the exact thing what i want it so now this time the regular expression instead of having greediness nature it is now lazy how we will try to see it so if you try to see here p tag yes it has found this p element fine and now here we are able to see the the wildcard character which is of zero or more times and here we are checking with a zero or one time at least zero or one time so the wildcard character center thing should be at zero or one time so that means first it will check for the zero nature so it will check for the zero nature means it, it is the it will be thinking that it does not exist then that means now it will search for the closing element so here it will go on searching for the closing element so here it whether it has found the closing element or not so it will go on finding it will go on find the closing element like this so find the closing element closing element. so immediately it has found this closing element here and stops the match and again it will start with the first thing and it will search for the instead of going to the end of the text and backtracking so from the first time itself it will go on matching for this closing p element instead of going at the end and backtracking so because of this lazy nature now we are able to find the four matches so here we are have we have added the question mark in such a way that it should repeat zero or one time so because of this zero so it will try it will think that it should not exist so it should uh, so at least zero times it should exist and now zero times it will search for the element so zero means so nothing is there here so it will search for this closing p element so it will go on searching for this p closing p element like this it will find so exact match was found and again it will search for this element so like this it will be going on so for example if i try to remove this star mark and if i try to keep the question mark now you'll be able to see that it will try to match exact zero or one but here we are having one or more right so because of this reason it is not able to find so that is the reason we are adding star and now it will try to find zero and it will try to find this one so like this the greediness nature we can convert into laziness using the question mark so hope you understood about this greediness and laziness nature so this is one of the important concept in the regular expression so how to convert the uh, greedy by default actually the regular expressions are nothing but the greedy in nature only so it will try to match as much text as it can so it will try to match it so if we try to mention dot star so it is going on matching this closing element and again the opening element so like this it is going on matching all the elements because of this reason so we are able to so find these things for example if i make it as a global thing so it will entire thing it will match again this entire thing it will match then afterwards it realized that okay i need to backtrack it so then it will backtrack this thing so this is how the greediness will be there in the regular expression hope you understood about this one if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you